Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Charles Gore and I'm the Executive Director of the Medicines Patent Pool. And I'm thrilled to announce the publication of a peer-reviewed analysis published by BMJ Global Health titled Negotiating Public Health Intellectual Property Licensing Agreements to Increase Access to Health Technologies, an insider's story. This analysis is co-authored by a small team of MPP staff and governance board members. As many of you may already know, the public health voluntary licensing of intellectual property rights has been instrumental in scaling up WHO recommended treatments for HIV and hepatitis C in low and middle income countries, resulting in substantial cost savings and many lives saved. Recent articles in the Lancet Public Health, the Lancet Global Health and the Journal of the International AIDS Society have demonstrated the effectiveness of this approach and its potential applicability to non-communicable diseases, emerging biotherapeutic medicines and long-acting technologies. Moreover, discussions at high-level forums like the World Health Organization, the Intergovernmental Negotiating Body and the G20 highlight the importance of equitable access to health technologies, especially, but not only, in the context of pandemics. Despite the undeniable success of public health voluntary licensing, there are recurring demands for these licenses to be improved, for example by expanding their geographic coverage. This analysis aims to provide an insider's perspective on our work, shedding light on how the medicines patent pool operates in practice. It discusses the challenges negotiation complexities and compromises involved and is part of our commitment to transparency. We firmly believe that understanding the nuances of our model is crucial for appreciating its value in global health. This knowledge can contribute significantly to ongoing discussions about equitable access to health technologies. In addition, it can help calibrate expectations, develop incentives and formulate supportive policies to expand the application of public health voluntary licensing. Public health voluntary licensing has been a game changer in improving access to essential medicines in low and middle income countries. However, its full potential remains untapped. We encourage you to read our paper, which is accompanied by an appendix illustrating the ways that key features of MPP licenses, some of which have become gold standard norms for public health licensing, are implemented in practice. We believe that through collaborative efforts and a deeper understanding of the MPP model, we can bridge the access gap in global healthcare and ensure that everyone, regardless of where they live, has access to the healthcare they deserve.